Psalm 126 states, when Adonai brought the captives back to Zion, they're in a dream, and their mouths were filled with song, and their tongues with shouts of joy. And then the nations said, the goyim in Hebrew said, the Gentiles, that would be most of us in this room, except for our VIP all up in here, and I feel the love, thank you. And then the Gentiles said, Adonai has done great things for them. And I asked my Jewish friends, and I've asked them for 30 years, when, when in the history of mankind have the Goyim ever gathered around the Jews and encouraged them, recognizing their God as God of gods, came along next to them and said, give me a J, give me an E, give me a W. What's that spell? You're, do you know who you are? You're the firstborn of the Most High God. You're the apple of His eye. You're a light to the nations. When has that ever happened? As the psalmist says, it's never happened. The Gentiles have been wicked enemies to the Jews, and no more so than the f Christian faith community throughout the history of our faith. Tonight, perhaps in a little bit, of fulfilling this prophecy, representing tens of millions, and certainly the 3.4 million Christians united for Israel and the Christian faith community. And here we say to our Jewish brothers and sisters, Oh, God bless you. Adonai has done. Adonai is doing. Adonai will do great things for you. You have been a light to this Gentile and to the Gentiles of the world, and we bless you. In the name of the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, could I have my Christian brothers and sisters stand and let's bless our Jewish friends tonight and thank God for them being a light to the nations, for bringing us the knowledge of the one true God. Your Christian brothers and sisters say, Toda Rabbah, Toda Rabbah to you. Oh, be strong, be of good courage, don't be discouraged. The Lord your God is with you wherever you go. God bless you. God bless you. Stay standing. Please stay standing for a moment. Stay standing because now I really want you to bless them. Stay standing because now it's going to be easy to get to your wallet and your purse. Stay standing. Shouting and yelling is easy and it's good though. Everybody needs encouragement. Kufi and campus, I'm just going to say it the best way I know how. We need more money. We're on 300 campuses. So what? We need to be on 3,000 campuses. We know how to do it. My brother, Mr. Lloyd, where are you? Shmuley, you here? Samuel Lloyd, right there. He travels probably 359 days a year. Campus to campus to campus to campus, raising up young men and women. We thank God for him and the handful of men like him around the nation. But we need more money to do what we're doing. So if you love the Jewish people, and you do, and you want to help us do more for the next generation, because in a blink of an eye, we're handing the baton to them. Ushers, get ready, please. Greeters, lock the doors. <laughs> Wives, grab your husband's wallet.